Yo, yo, yo. What is good, YouTube? Coach Mike back, day 22 of the weight loss. And I'm currently weighing in on this beautiful Wednesday, 231.3. So we dropped, uh, didn't really drop anything since yesterday, but uh, we are losing a little something. And I'm sure I might gain it back somehow. So. We'll see how this weight loss goes for summer, but I am looking, my muscles are looking pretty good in the mirror, so I can't even complain about not losing weight, but uh, I will eventually have to lose the weight because my waist is pretty much, when I gain fat, my fat goes to my waist. And so all my shorts and all my pants, you know, all my summer clothes are in like 32, I think I wear like a 33 waist when I'm at like 215, 210 ish. And now I'm probably at like a 34, 34 and a half. So I got to lose the weight for summer so I can fit into the shorts comfortably. So I will, if I don't lose weight, you know, just, just eating regularly, I'll have to increase my cardio or do two a days at the gym, which, you know, always fun doing that. I love doing two a days, waking up at six, no, waking up at 7 a.m., going to the gym, uh, doing cardio, throwing on uh, a new set of clothes for work, and then uh, doing it all over again after work. It's not doesn't get better than that. So we might have to resort to that because uh, right now my diet is pretty solid. Um, besides the snacking on uh, on the weekends, but you know I can cut that out easily. Come on, I can not eat that Domino's pizza. But yeah, we will have to start ramping up the diet. So I might have to work out a little bit longer, do an extra couple sets, extra cardio. I decrease my carbs maybe a little more, but I'm already, I already took on my carbs on my last meal of the day. So I replaced that with a cucumber. So I just eat a whole cucumber with my chicken before uh, I usually go to bed, usually like an hour, hour and 30 minutes before I go to bed. So if that doesn't work, uh, we have to increase the intensity of the workouts. So before I get into making my shake, I wanna give a shout out to one of my viewers, Steve Ann from Denver. So uh, thanks for watching the videos and uh, hopefully you get a good workout in today. So let's get into the shakes. So you guys know what I make. Uh, bucked up, orange OG, killer OJ, creatine, and the knockoff citrulline. So I guess today's video we can talk about uh, me living like pretty simple life and pretty much the benefits of it. So my life's pretty like stress free. I don't really have a lot of stress and I try to avoid stressful situations. Like I don't really take uh, risky situations. You know, I keep my life pretty simple. I go to work, kind of like an life and an NPC, but at least I'm being productive. So I go to work. I work from home, so I don't really need to, you know, commute anywhere, which saves me the stress of not really worrying about traffic in the morning. You know, I, I rarely even drive anymore, to be honest. I think I drive, like, maybe a couple miles a week now, but before when I was commuting, it would be, like, 30-minute drive, and then you gotta worry about traffic and everything, and, like, now that I don't have to worry about driving anywhere, it's like a big time saver. I save like an hour, and I couldn't imagine commuting down here because down here the traffic's horrible. So the commute would be even longer. So I definitely don't have to worry about commuting, and I can just work from my apartment, which is awesome for the time being, as long as uh, that lasts, and hopefully it lasts for a while with the with the uh, the way the economy's going. Hopefully I uh, keep my job, so it'd be really cool. If not, you know, we'll make do with it. So yeah, I keep, I keep my life pretty simple. I, you know, I go to work. Um, I eat pretty, pretty, I, I don't really, see, you know, eat crazy meals because I don't like doing a ton of dishes, you know. I can get all my, all the, you know, real healthy foods and chicken, rice, and a couple of vegetables a day. And I drink oat milk, which has a bunch of vitamins. And I take a few vitamins and um, some other stuff daily, but... I don't go crazy on these crazy pastas or like crazy meals where you gotta spend hours doing because I just don't really have the time to do that all the time. You know, I gotta put out a video for this channel in the time being. 
I like to point out videos on this channel because it kind of gets my butt into the gym and uh, it helps me track my weight progress and you know every video I put out I see my physique you know you can see me standing here you don't see a giant gut on me if I come back 20 days later hey right, guys I'm back and I just have a gut on me it's like where did all that come from you know you can see the progress every day if you put out a video or if you take a picture of yourself every day so that's why I like do it you know I don't really care about the views I just like talking to a camera all day you know at least for 15 minutes and it's pretty much why I make the videos so I uh, work I make the videos I go work out for I usually work out for about 45 minutes to an hour and then uh I'll drink the protein shake, pure protein, you know, and then um, I'll do like 20, 30 minutes of cardio to keep the heart health up because, uh, you know, heart disease is the number one killer in humans, so you got to keep up your cardio, so I highly recommend doing cardio, you know, and it helps me eat a little bit more throughout the day. I notice if I do cardio, you know, I eat more, you know, I'm more hungry, so it's always a good thing, so I get more protein in. And then, yeah, you know, I just kind of hang around my apartment from Monday to Friday. I will just pretty much do the same routine every day. And uh, when I get back from the gym, I'll post this video and then I'll think of an idea for my other channel, which I'm like 60 subs away from a thousand. So I'll think of an idea for the other channel and then I'll make a video about that. And I'll usually just hang around with uh, Discord with a bunch of my friends, playing games or uh, I'll read the news or watch a documentary. And then uh, I'll do it all over again from Monday pretty much to Friday. And then on the weekends, you know, I might go out um, traveling. I might, you know, <laughs> I have a busy schedule in the next next few months on the weekends because I like to travel all the time pretty much. So I might go back home to like Buffalo. I might go to the beach. I might visit a friend in a different state. I might go visit my sister. Like I like traveling because it kind of puts you in a different environment you can see new people uh new foods you know new foods and new places I, i'm a big food lover uh, i love eating local cuisine every time i go somewhere so i like to travel and i like to see new things because it's nice since i work inside all day i don't really get to see the outside you know sad as it sounds when you work from home you don't really interact with people in the day besides you might have a couple meetings with your coworkers, but that's not like a physical interaction, you know, I definitely, <laughs> I definitely think my social skills have went down since I started working from home, and that's okay, you know, it's just one of the uh, cons from working from home, but, you know, you have to go out and, like, see the sunlight every now and again, so, uh, yeah, that's pretty much my simple life, I try to keep it simple, stress-free, you know, pay my bills, save up for, I don't even know what I'm saving up for now, I wanted to get a car, but it's just, again, a car note. It's like, I can, I could do it, but you gotta go to the dealership and then you gotta deal with all the, yeah, we got these markups going on right now. We're selling for MSRP, but we got these 5K markups, you know, it's got tinted windows and stuff. Like, I just don't feel like dealing with that stuff. And like, that's why I kind of wanted to buy a Tesla because you don't have to deal with all that BS. But Tesla, Tesla uh, mm, loaning rates, the APRs on their loans are like high sevens. So you have to get like, if you want to buy one, you got to like finance it through a credit union or something, just like a whole fiasco. You know, there's nothing really wrong with my truck right now. It might get the occasional error or issue, but it drives fine and I barely even drive. So like, that's why like, I don't really need a new car, but it would be nice to have a new car. Cause my truck has a few dents in it and stuff. You know, it doesn't have power windows or power locks. So it's like pretty old school, but it gets me there and back. And even though I have to park in the back of parking lots, it is what it is. You know, I can use the extra cardio, I always say. So every time I park in the back of a parking lot, I can use the extra cardio, that's no big deal. So I guess that'll be the video about me living a simple life, uh, working out, we're doing probably just another full body workout today. We'll hit everything. My chest isn't as sore today, so I'll probably be pressing some weights. And uh, I've been doing arms a lot because I want my arms to grow. And I know, you know, you gotta let you gotta let your arms repair and stuff, but I don't really care. I wanna do arms, I'll do arms. It's no big deal. So this will be the day, day 22, uh, 231.3. And hopefully tomorrow I'll be under 231. Uh, hopefully, if I'm lucky, under 230, but 
if I get your full layer Kudoba after after my work, I don't know if that's really gonna happen. We'll see. We'll see how I'm feeling though. So thanks for watching my video, and uh, I'll catch you for day 23 tomorrow.